I would look at uh, certainly advanced degrees uh, or credentialing of any kind helps you with maybe the theoretical aspects of some of the IT spaces, but they also, you know, it, you, you get this pedigree. You have an understanding, fundamental understanding of whether it's identity management, cybersecurity, Microsoft Network Engineer. You get a certification. You get yourself able to be counted as, well, he knows, he or she knows a certain amount. So, so I think that's one place to go. I think some of the professional organizations are a great place, again, A, to network, and B, to learn things. Because this is, you know, you, you got to get it through your head, these young people, that you're going to continue to learn throughout your career. And you have to actually want to learn and go out and find these folks. So they become a networking environment for you as well as a professional resource. Because when you want to move from job to job to job, in theory, you're going to climb here or there. You know, the reason you get jobs is something to do with what your credentials are. But it's a lot to do with, does the person hiring you trust you? Do they know you and trust you? So back to the networking piece. So, so those facets, I think, are the things that I would advise the young people to sort of move towards.